Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First, we'll understand our question. The program has to accept uh, n cross n character matrix as the input and then accept q queries that is integer x and y then for each queries So for each query, the program must replace all the characters from row x to row y to asterisk and then similarly the program must replace all the characters from row that is replace all the characters from column x to column y to matrix and if the cell has already asterisk then it must be replaced with the original character. And then finally, we'll print the modified matrix as the output so first we are going to accept the n cross n character matrix and accept q queries and integer x and y and for each query the program must replace all the characters from row x to row y to asterisk and the program must replace all the characters from column x to column y to matrix sorry to asterisk and if the cell has already asterisk, then it means we have to replace with the original character. And finally, we have to print the modified matrix. So first we'll take our test case. So in this test case, we have n as 7 and we have two queries. So first we'll copy this. And we'll make the changes here. So let us take our first query that is 2 and 3. So now we have to change the second row and the third row to asterisk. So yes, we have changed them to asterisk. And then also we have to change the second column. and the third column to asterisk so here it is so let's change them asterisk asterisk so here asterisk is already present so we have to replace it with the original character so the original character is k and here it is o so k and o and then for the remaining characters in that column will be in asterisk and similarly for the third column we have x to be in asterisk then this is also asterisk and here for these two characters we'll replace the original characters that is b and u and 
we'll go to the next query that is 5 to 7 so we'll replace the 5th row, 6th row and 7th row with the asterisk so these are the 3 rows so C will be changed to asterisk and then here asterisk is already present so we'll replace it with the original character that is Z and W and other remaining characters will be changed to asterisk and then for the sixth row similarly characters will be changed to asterisk and the asterisk will be changed to the original character C O and then for the last row F will be changed to asterisk and asterisk will be changed to the original character and then we'll have the asterisk and for columns there is fifth sixth and seventh column we are going to replace with asterisk so these are the three columns the characters will be replaced with asterisk but when it comes to asterisk we are going to replace it with the original characters so for all these three columns we'll replace with the original character so gxp and then tr w and then q r g and then we have u k u and then r t h so this will be our final output now let us implement our program first we'll get our integer n and after that we'll get our matrix that is input of dot split of for row in range n so after getting a matrix we'll have a temporary matrix where we are going to store the rows from the matrix so the temporary matrix is equal to the row of the matrix that is the rows will be represented as row colon and for row in matrix so we'll take over each row and then after getting the temporary matrix We'll get the queries as input and then we'll iterate over the number of queries that is 1 comma q plus 1 and for each query we are going to get the x comma y as the input and after that we are going to replace the rows of x and y that is x minus 1 to y so 
so these rows will be changed also for the column for column in range 0 comma n if the matrix of the row column is equal to equal to asterisk means so if it is asterisk then we are going to change it to the original character so matrix of row column will be equal to the temporary matrix of row column so as the temporary matrix is the copy of the matrix and in the else part we'll have the matrix of row column equal to asterisk so if there is a original character it will be changed to asterisk and similarly we'll have it for for column in range x minus 1 comma y minus 1 we'll have the same code only certain changes will be there and here it is row and here and all it is similar so finally for row in matrix we are going to print asterisk row now let us run our program We'll pass our first test case. Yes, we have got the correct output. The characters are replaced with asterisk and asterisk are replaced with characters. Now we will pass our second test case. Here also we have got the correct output. Our program has passed all our given test cases successfully. Hope you guys understand. Thanks for watching. See you next video.